Hello ladies and gentlemen, yes, Zeke here again today to bring you another episode of Let's Play RimWorld. So I have a bit of explaining to do. Um, I essentially didn't save properly after my last recording session, so I had to go back to an autosave. So things are a tiny bit, but not much different than they were in the previous video. You'll see, I guess, when it loads, and I'm not sure why I decided to start here. Um, if I remember properly, it's like raining and day 11, and then I created the save from there. Um, so just to recap what I'm doing in case some things are done that I didn't want done or things are done that I do want done, but in different orders. Um, I have this as my storage room now. I have this as my chunks room. I've created a larger room here for chunks and I've kept support pillars up. I don't know how or at what interval I'm actually supposed to be placing those. Um, I have also designated some animals for hunting. And uh, that's pretty much it. I have all this done, including the chairs. The chunks are to be hauled. The everything is to be hauled, really. If you don't think about it at all, um, is Misty actually currently just hauling though? What is Misty doing? Misty is hauling limestone chunks. Okay, that is perfect. I'm also getting this big area done here, which is indoors because it is inside the mountain, which is lovely fire. Well, that shouldn't be too much of a problem when it's raining. Yeah, so I'm, I'm sorry about things being slightly different. It is still the 11th day of summer, which I'm pretty sure is where it ended last time. Um, and while I have the chance, I am going to go ahead and go to zone area and actually increase this dumping stockpile zone area. I've also moved some of this stuff so that this can be my medical area. So let's set this to medical and medical. And that all the hauling will get done on earth as it is in heaven. I guess, I don't know. Does hauling get done in heaven? Fuck if I know. <laughs> Do I even know if there is a heaven? Well, could be. I don't really personally believe it, but I'm not gonna say discount the fact that it could exist. Another thing I should do is actually build out some real walls, but I'd really like to stone cut first. Oh my god, the fire! Um, is this not in the home area? Because you, you don't actually, yeah, this is not in the home area, so let's expand this and then make sure some... Misty, 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 Misty. What are you doing? You're not beating out fire. Everybody come and extinguish this fucking fire, okay? Got four firefighters. I should be able to make this um, go out. Come on, guys. You can do it. What? what? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, expand home zone a bit more. First of all, all this should be my home area. Everything in here should be my home area. Actually, even everything out here should be my home area. Now go and put out that fucking fire, guys. Where are you guys going? Guys! Prioritize extinguishing the fire, Misty. Fire time, man. Reality. Already fighting the fire. Sariva, what are you doing with the fire? Are you fighting it? No, you're not. Fight the goddamn fire. There we go. Better. Let's also go architect um, floors. Make this a slightly nicer place. And um, maybe while I'm at it, I can deconstruct this. Or not reinstall this in somebody's bedroom just to make it slightly nicer. Um, this has become not a dumping zone, which is good. Go to architect. I'm actually going to destroy this entire wall here and then turn it into a real wall so that I can have a door into the fridge so that people can get into the dining room pretty easily. And to that end, I'm going to be putting furniture, a long table, right adjacent to there. And I'm going to be reinstalling these chairs so that they are at the long table. Reinstall at here, and reinstall at here. And then I'm going to be building a couple more too, because that man's got to do what a man's got to do. Make sure that I have enough room to grow in the future. But then I'm gonna turn this into a joy room. I cannot make a billiards table at present because I don't have cloth. 
But I can have that, and I can have two chess tables. Which I should have probably made of steel, so let's cancel that. And make some steel chess tables. I have so much goddamn steel. And make them... They have to be two apart, so that they can fit chairs. Then go furniture, get some chairs going on. Right here, and right here, and here, and here. And then, now I have a decent joy room. Decent-ish. Also, architect. Go to zone area and make myself another growing zone. Um, a pretty big one, actually, like an 8x8 eight eight even. Another 8x8. Eight eight. And this growing area should actually be growing cotton plants. Lovely. That should do the trick. Really need to get that hauling done, but Misty's the one cooking, so he isn't having as much time to haul as I might like. Kira's doing a good job growing our cotton there. Um, minor break risk, need joy source. I know I'm working on both of those things even as we speak. Misty doing some good dumping. Um, everybody eating. Isn't this... Yeah, this is to be relocated, so are all these. But apparently we are waiting for a bit later to relocate them properly. I should also... This is a good bow. Is it Reality Jaunt who does not have a weapon? Equip this this good bow, this good great bow. Even though it's almost broken because it's been out, of, out here too long. And then, is anyone else missing a weapon? There we go. Now everybody's armed at least. That's a good thing. Means I can post everybody up on these sandbags and get ready to destroy, if need be. I'll also put some um, turrets out there in the future if I ever get my research together. I should also make a bill for this tailoring bench in order to get some parkas ready for the winter. So I'm going to do until you have um, five, or just say two. Just two extras hanging out. And then I would really like somebody to actually work as the tailor. The issue is our best tailor is also are also the only people who can haul. Um, Misty is our best, I think. Well, of the people who have passion at all, which you want. So I guess you, um, Smith and Taylor at level two, because why not, right? You know what? Put your hunting at level three. Because it's more important that you smith or tailor. Um, this is a sculptor table. Um, add bill. Make a s small sculpture. Um, you want to disallow... First of all, why would you ever allow rotten? Disallow pretty much everything that's valuable. Except for maybe steel. Steel's not that bad to make a sculpture out of right now. So, I don't know if we have any good artists. At all? I think we do have a couple. We have at least somebody with a double- Reality Jaunt! That is perfectly, um, suitable here. And also, I think Reality Jaunt struggles to do anything much sometimes, so... He's essentially just our warden, and he's good at constructing things. So let's put him at, like, level 2 for art, so he can do art whenever he's not doing anything else. I wish this room was a bit nicer, but I think right now it's because it's very dirty. This room is starting to get to positive beauty, or it's starting to get to not be ugly. Which is fantastic. I'm good with some not ugly stuff. Got some chairs going on, got some tables going on. Um, running out of wood again. So let's actually do an order to chop some wood up here. Yeah, those are ready to chop, and so are those. And how about these? All those are ready to chop. Get them done close into our base, because why not? Make sure that all the stuff we actually need to be in here is in here. That is going well. It also um, consolidated our little stack of, of, of stone there, so that's kind of nice. Okay, castaway named Alice Tkoi calls you ne from nearby. She's being chased by tribes people from Kamisa of Duck. She begs it. She's 21 years old. I think I'm going to accept it. Let's offer her safety. Um, I'm going to need to fight off the tribes people. So, she has clothes on. And I think they're synth thread clothes, too. So, that's really good, I guess. Um, high quality, not deteriorating at all. Worth a lot of money, at the very least. Um, 
please be good at something. She's hugely passionate about um, shooting in melee. So that's good. I should probably give her a weapon and make her hunt. But what can she do for work? Can she haul or clean? Okay, you both haul and clean at top priority. Other than that, you hunt at level 2, and um, all the rest at level 3 is actually pretty good. Just don't doctor people ever, please. Be a patient. Be this. Handle. Don't cook, please. Um, actually, don't handle either. But you can hunt at level 2 to improve your gun use when we actually have a gun for you in the future. So we got cargo pods going on. Jump to location. What have I got in them? Oh, raid is happening. A um, bunch of limestone blocks. Yeah, that could be good. Are they just attacking immediately? Attacking immediately. Okay. So everybody draft up and get into your positions. Everybody has ranged weapons. We should be fine. Actually, this should be a slaughter, if I'm not mistaken. I could be mistaken. I really want this place to be clean. And I want everything to be hauled, which is why I'm really glad I got another person. Although it might need to mean I need more food pretty soon. And this should be for prisoners. Who at this point I'm just going to replace all of because... Or, um, release all of almost immediately because that just seems like the best idea. Ignorant Winter being a total badass here. Oh my god, this is much more of a an issue than I expected. Now they're all retreating. That is fantastic. Um... Seemingly, they're all dead as well. Let's undraft here. Ignorant was the only one injured. He can rest. And undraft all of them, too. No ranged weapons, huh? Okay, interesting. Let's go ahead and set these people to be stripped. I don't know what their gear is, but... And then... Set these to be usable. They're good clubs at the very least. You guys are just eating those meals that they had on them? Okay, fair enough. Colonist needs treatment. As far as I know, he's currently going to get treatment. That's good. Is he our best doctor? I hope not. Ignorant, you're not our doctor, are you? You are a doctor. Kira is our main doctor. Kira, why are you sleeping instead of treating Ignorant Winter? Prioritize treating our architect. Slash your husband. Just saying, Kira. How could you be so rude? There we go. Got everything going on there. Everything's all good. And I'm having a good time. He got wrecked, but he, um, Rocco, the male warg. I guess that's what I get for getting a warg. Pretty um, pretty useful. Almost can haul as well. So I'm looking forward to that happening. Really wish um we could train him more quickly. More quickly. Feeling glad I got sunshine. Oh my god, this place is so full. Architect. Um, zone area. Dumping zone. Expand that so we can put more blocks in this place. We need more places to put blocks, unfortunately. I'm liking having this room here because I just need so much storage for these chunks and I need that storage right next to here so that we can properly stone cut in the future and get some good floors and walls going on. Also now that I have more people, who is my best researcher? You are, Kira? Um, you're pretty much... I don't want you to haul anymore, instead research at top priority, at secondary priority, let's say. You should grow first, you should plant cut first, and then, yeah, and then you research. Ignorant doing some art? Oh, it would be perfect if reality was doing art. Why is, do I have ignorant and reality working on art here? Yes, I do. Oh, because ignorant's a much better artist, actually. It's just that um, reality has more passion for it and will get better. Sorry, reality. Shit happens sometimes. God, he works on that art super fast. I'm gonna put that in the workshop area just to make it a bit more beautiful when it's ready. I think that is probably our best idea. And who should our new character be? Um, you're not very good at anyth anything, but you have passion for shooting and for melee. Um, you're you're sanguine, meaning you bleed a lot. 
permanent mood effect plus 12 just upbeat that's not what sanguine means is it okay she has bloodlust that's all right but i'm appreciating the mood bonus and the fact that our mood's been pretty overall good if i go to my history here my wealth has been permanently on the uptick and um my colonist mood is hanging out over 60 like all the time so i appreciate that Rocco's healing up nicely. Um, only needs one more bit of training. Misty, you just need to train him one more time. Minor break risk on Sariva. Um, don't know why exactly. Reality is... Okay. Once this is done, once this specific project is done, I'm actually going to take... Um, ignorant off of art. thing is, he has the same problem as reality, except he can smith and tailor. He's just bad at it. So you stop doing art. Um, let's get this installed in here. Just to make the room a bit nicer. Cure is researching. Um, I can also put Ignorant as a researcher. He does have some passion for it at the very least. So that'll be his second priority. And now that I can get Misty Pony off of Pauline, I can put him on tailoring as like number one. So get those parkas done, man, if you can. Not sure if we have enough um, leather to do any parkas at all, but I'm hoping we do. It's a lot of um, pigskin we got over there, mufflo leather. You know, it's decent. It's a boar that we have set to hunt just hanging out right there. Man, Misty, sometimes you are just not a very good shot. Wild Boar Revenge. Well, Rocco's got this. Prioritize hunting this fucking boar. Don't just leave Rocco to fucking kill it on his on your own, you dickbag. Okay, fortunately, he doesn't need to need to be healed. There we go. Some extra stuff going on there. Research is going pretty well. Kira, um, Kira has five research and a double passion for it, so that is going to tick up super fast. Already learned the max today, though. And Ignorant's now going to do some research and learn some um, something about research too, which is nice. Now, if only um, Misty would haul all the steel out of his room. That is in the home area, right? Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Misty's going to bed. Rocco is um, going to... Oh, he's uh, he learned to haul. Wait, this disallows food? Storage. Disallow food, man. Oh, no. It's a mirage. I'm telling all y'all it's sabotage. The food needs to go into here. Fortunately, all that really made its way in here is um, like rice, which lasts two seasons anyways. And potatoes, which last a season and 11 days. So that should be fine. What? Oh, and some of the clothing. Oh, it could be worse. Got some joy time going on. Everybody's joy is like, look at Kira's joy. Look at Kira's joy. Why are you so happy? Got a mad animal going on. Jump to location. Oh, is it a mad boom rat? It's a mad fucking boom rat. Okay. This is this is a horrible situation. Um, Misty and Sariva get drafted. You run, run away, run away. Just get wrecked, please. Get wrecked sooner than later. Oh no. Okay. Ah, uh, heal up. Fire. Um, you guys undraft. And um, take care of this fire, please. Yeah, they're already doing it. That's a good thing. They're both heading to... 
You need to... Oh, you're still drafted. Yeah, you need to heal over... Head over there and heal. Cure will get you. Rocco's nearly nearly completely healed already, which is fantastic. Um, got some food shit going on that I don't want to go on in here, but that is all right. How long does it take for herbal medicine to expire? Two years. And perfect time for a raid, really, uh, if, you, if you stop to not think about it at all. Are they attacking immediately? They are attacking immediately. Who are they? Um, they have a club. They have a sniper rifle. And they have Molotov cocktails. Okay, so... Fortunately, everybody is like right here and can draft up and immediately take all the cover. Okay, let's play this at normal speed, make sure nobody gets too injured. Watch that guy with the Molotovs, because he could be an issue. Really need to get like a good kill zone set up here. His name is Earth? That's a weird name, man. Ow, Kira. That really hurts. Reality Jaunt, you are... You should actually go melee attack for Earth right now. Ignorant. Here's your move over here. Okay, Earth is down. Melee attack Philly. He's the one we want down next. Oh, there we go. Melee attack Boone. Please don't shoot ignorant anyone. Okay. Everybody undraft. And put out that fucking fire as quickly as, you're, as possible. Takoy, what's your issue? Okay, Sariva, you go and equip the sniper rifle. Set these two to be stripped. They are both dead. You're uninjured, so that's fantastic. Um, capture ship right here. Uh, Misty Pony, you go ahead and equip this rifle. And then we just need to find somebody who has a bow, I think reality. And he can equip the handgun. Don't want to be wasting any ranged weapons that are any good at all. Quit pistol. There we go. Definitely want these Molotovs too. They will at least make good sales. And we got some recreational drugs over here. Some wake-ups. Which sounds like a good time to shake up. Um, something, 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 something. Makeup. Have you healed Ignorant Winter yet? Yes, you have. Lovely. Um, somebody's going to need to heal you. Or you're gonna need to like heal yourself. How are you doing, Kira? Artery blockage burn from my Molotov cocktail. Unfortunately, we really need Kira for other things at the moment. Not to mention this should also be. We also need to make one more room. So let's go ahead and go architect. Um, orders, mine. Just mine it a bit further down here. And I'm actually going to want this room to be almost double the size. So we start from one, one here. Okay, five, six, seven, eight. Then I want nine, ten. So it's ten wide, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine long this way. And the reason I want it this big, and I know this is huge, is to actually build a wall inside of it that will make the room nicer looking. So it's really gonna be half this size, so. Yeah, right there. And for now, cancel all this path going here. I think we should be good. Oh, poor Kira, poor Kira. What a horrible time. And actually, let's go architect right here. Make sure that I have uh, a door onto the hospital. Make it out of steel, because we have so much steel again. I just, I, I have like steel coming out my ass at the moment. Far more steel than I could ever, than my body has room for. 
Did I just run out of wood before I built this one floor tile, or did I never assign it to be built? Yeah, I just never assigned it to be built. Okay, that's a bit weird. So this is my experimental room here. See exactly what happens. Reality jumps in bed and healing up. Kira's now sleeping to heal up. Um, I think Ignorant is our second best doctor. Earth? So, what, what are you? You're fantastic at constructing and mining. You'd be perfect for our colony, but I really cannot... cannot have you. Industrious, global work speed plus 35% and depressive. Oh, that's such a good and such a bad thing. Okay, um, let's strip him. And then set him to be, um, to be just released. Why strip him? Because I want his clothes. Why do you think strip him? I also need some of this shit to be hauled back in. Um, cloth duster, it might be awful, but, you know... It's at the same time pretty good. If that makes any sense. Kevlar helmet. Takoi is out. What is she doing? Hey, Takoi, um, can you... Well, first of all, Takoi, I need to rename you. Um, you are going to be... You're going to be Ren. Because that makes sense to me. Well, mostly because I failed to name the person Ren who actually had... Morgan is apparently... She commented this, so I'm assuming I can say it. Morgan is apparently her real name, so... That's kind of cool, right? Let's haul this duster at the very least. To make sure that we have another piece of winter clothing. What's our boar doing? Is he hauling shit? I just really need people to get shit hauled. What? Viewing art. Right now, man? Then that was when you're gonna haul this art? Or view this art? Let's also make a work order real quick to chop some more wood, because I, I really desperately need some more wood. Major break risk. What? What? Sorry, what? First of all, why? Ugly environment, witnessed outsider's death, wearing worn out apparel, ate without a table, in a little pain, very ugly environment. Okay, first of all, what I should do is I should go to assign and change, change any, edit the anything outfit to not allow rotten and only allow um, as low as 40% quality. Um, and then everybody should put out that fire. Also, we should go architect, power, and build a conduit right here. I'd unfortunately completely drained our batteries, um, so our freezer is going to be in a bit of a spot for a bit. We should also go architect orders, mine, and mine out some more of this fridge so we have some more fridge available. You know, just in the future. In the future, the mighty future, our fridge will something tonight. And maybe while I'm at it, um, go with another power structure here and build another solar generator. Major break risk still, Sariva. Um, is it because you are now naked? Isn't there some better stuff you can put on, like some of this stuff maybe? 45, yeah, that, that's, a, that's a thing you can put on. What about, that's a 10%. Sorry, but why don't you put on this shirt? Oh, okay, she'll put it on herself if she wants it. Rare thrombos, don't care. Um, can't really repair a, a stone wall. I don't think, anyways. Got some horseshoes going on there. Um, Serva's mood is going back up. No longer has a break risk. So that is at least a positive, I guess. I just wish we were hauling a bit faster, guys. Maybe I should assign everybody who can to hauling priority one, just so the hauling happens all the time. Oh, look at all this steel in the fridge. Hunter lacks ranged weapon. Um... Mental break, sad wander. Oh, I didn't even see that. Uh, Sariva, of course. Did your bad mental condition wasn't that bad. Why are you sad wandering? And why are you not released yet? Can... 
Who's our warden? Warden reality. Reality, can you just go and... No, don't clean this guy. Why is he not released? Didn't I tell you to release him? Yeah, release him. So... Was it reality that I said? Why won't you release him? Okay, we got all his clothes stored now. But why can't we release him? Mufflo self-tamed. Just a straight up Mufflo? Oh yeah, we might as well train him, right? Give him at least tank some hits. Got some animal sleeping spots going on. Yeah! Fed him potatoes, now he's trained. And he is... Not bonded to anybody, but, you know. I'm good with the self-tamed muffle. Where, where, where are you? Where? What are you doing? Oh. Trying to hunt that raccoon, huh? Fair enough, Misty. Um, although I would much prefer if you were to haul some shit. Oh, I took you off of hauling entirely? Um, how about you haul with priority one? Because... You know what? You haul with priority two. I just really need this shit hauled. Okay, let's um go architect. Structure. Wall made of wood. Get this room a tiny bit prettier. This isn't indoors, right? Steel door. Wood wall. All the way down here. All the way down here. And all the way down here. So this room is eight. And then also architect. Furniture. Double bed. Put that right here. Put a pot of plant right here. I can't really see, so I'm having a hard time with this. And then put a standing lamp right here. Try to get as much of the room lit as possible, right? Fucking muffalo. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Why isn't he being released? Okay, so, reality. Can I not release you without, um... Without first giving you clothing? And I really wish we would get these things stored. Speaking of which, you should equip this bow even though it's 33% quality and you're probably doing other things at the moment that are maybe even more important. And you should haul, haul these Molotovs, because they're valuable, they're worth money. Okay, that probably made Ren unhappy. Everybody is pretty happy now. Suriva is especially happy now, which is um, weirdly surprising. And actually, if I if I go back to my history here, and okay, wealth is a bit on the down, but Colonist Moon generally on a bit of an uptick. Good times are ahead. Um, should probably go ahead and also go architect floors here, and maybe even put a wood floor in. This is gonna be my fanciest room by far. Don't have much wood left. Oh, I have plenty of wood left, actually. You guys are failing at the hauling business. Okay, finally all that got hauled in. People are gathering the wood as well and building things with it, or at least bringing it into the storage area. Um, increase the size of the stockpile zone. Should still only need one cooler to cool it, I think. Still have room stats on right now. Well, so far so good. I could use maybe a bit more room in here in order to put chunks in. Because I, I have a lot of chunks. So let's go architect orders. Throw down another mining order. 
and do it like this. I think this should be fine. Actually, it should be a bit higher up now that I look at it. So cancel. Probably right there. That's as close as I'm going to get, I think. Then I can expand the, um, the chunk storage room that I have. Does anybody have high priority cleaning? Only Ren. And this can now be assigned to be Wrens. Fantastic, everybody has rooms. This room is god-awful, but yeah, could be worse. It, it will eventually be our best room. No, just saying. Happiness is near an all-time high, I think. Although Ren seems pretty unhappy at the moment. Probably because her room's full of rock. Seems likely. Make sure that these get hauled. Except for these, which I should, um... No, no I, I want them not to be hauled. You don't understand. Cancel. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> oh, look at my mining colon colonists. They're so good at mining. Look how fast they go. Is there a reason that he's never been freed? And just, like, using our food? Because that's what he's doing, right? He's just using our food. That's all, that's all he's good for. Still have, like, a constant 18 meals or 20 meals? I guess so. Have cotton now as well, which actually makes for a good time because I can go joy and build myself a billiards table right in the main joy room here. Things are going pretty well, guys. I like where it's... Is this Devil Strand? No, Boom Rat Leather. Yeah, because I'm going to be building so many clothing, uh, so much clothing out of Boom Rats. Let's go and increase our dumping zone area by this much. There we go. More room for rocks. More room for the rocks. We need it. Hmm. Cargo pods again. Let's jump to the location and see what we got. Um, chicken eggs, unfertilized, so we can't hatch them, but we can at least um, eat them, I guess. We probably now have Misty preparing good meals, but we don't have that much meat. So... And we don't really need the happiness buff, in all honesty. Got our chest tables, we have our um, wooden horseshoe pin. We're pretty much all good. Ren's probably in a hideous environment right now, if I had to guess. We're, what are your needs like? You're still in a pretty good mood, because you're sanguine. And extremely comfortable. Did they build you a good bed? Oh, they built you a good bed. Nicely done. Ignorant Winter's just getting some late night research done. Because you know Ignorant Winter. That's how it does. That's how he bees. That's how he A, B, C, D, Z, Z, F, G, Z, 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 so the kind of shitty thing about this whole setup, though, is that we do not have nearby access to geothermal power. Like, not that we can easily defend. Raid time! Um, they're preparing for a while, so I might as well wait for everybody to be up and about. Where are they coming from? Jump to location. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Um, except they all have clubs and bows. So, I probably have the tech advantage on them. I'd really like to get this research done quite quickly. Uh, after this, I can build the better research bench. Right now, Ignorant's doing most of our research, and he does not have a good research skill. Kira has our best research skill, but um, has other things to do generally, because she's our grower, especially during the summertime. When the living is easy, fish are jumping. And the cotton is high. 
So what do I have? You have a bow. Maybe take the Molotovs? That seems like a really bad idea to use near my base. I think not take the Molotov. Zuh. Also got um, a lot of stone, a lot of limestone blocks. That's kind of nice, I guess. Everybody enjoy your joy time for now. So we have a bow. We have a sniper. We have a gun. We have a gun. And a knife and a bow again. Everybody can fight. That's at least a good thing. Kira's not drafted. So I should add, at some point, just select my entire base and draft them. Only when I'm being attacked, though. So let's go for a quick fast forward for a bit. Get your finger on the play button, though, just in case. Oh, beginning of their assault. Everybody get drafted. And get the fuck over here. Ren, you head... Oh. Ren, get over here. And I don't know who else is heading to a weird location. What's going on? Um, ignorant, you should probably not take the center shooting position since you have a melee weapon and that's all you're really good for. So Sariva, you do that and you can actually kind of like hide behind here and just get ready to ambush. They're going to take a little while to get here, apparently. Maybe had some more time on my hand. Hands. I only have one hand, guys. And this raid is probably going to, like, signal the end of the episode. Why? Spoils in two days. Definitely, like, gather that. We could use all the muffalo leather. So Ignorant's just kind of waiting behind this corner in order to ambush these guys and kill the hell out of whoever, whoever walks by him. Ignorant, melee attack him. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, Ignorant, you are in trouble. Oh, God, colonist needs rescue. Just chop the fuck out of Ignorant. I just want this person dead. Yeah, thank you. Um... Damn, that kind of sucked. Ignorant. Um, okay, first of all, everybody get on. Everybody get undrafted. Um, Sariva, you are wearing nothing. Just pants. Not very good pants either. Um, you go rescue ignorant. These guys have got to be stripped. Might as well take the um, take the clubs. Master were great bow. Who still has a great bow that is not masterwork? Kira? Here, take a masterwork. Uh, actually, I think Ren has a bow too, but it sucks. So equip the... Or, but she's better at shooting. So equip this masterwork's great bow. And then Kira, you can equip this good great bow. And then these guys all need to be stripped. Because we got some good clothes going on here. And then let's fast forward and hope all this gets stored. Oh, you should also be stripped. Fortunately, I not many people have to be exposed to this dead body, and Ren seems to be in charge of hauling the bodies. Which is essentially ideal, since she has the permanent mood buff. Ignorant and Reality are both in the hospital and being healed by Kira. They should be fine, and you are still not free. Why are you still not free, and why have you been sleeping for days? Mad animal. Good time. Jump to location. Um, is it the turkey? No, you're just wandering. Okay, well, mark it as hunt. Then press play. You're going quite a ways to attack Misty here, I, I gotta say. Um, Suriva. Get drafted and maybe hide behind these rocks and just get ready to attack this mad rat that's coming at us. I feel like I should actually clear out this wall and these these stones here in order to just make this more open for myself to shoot. Because at this point they get cover on the way through. Is there actually our best shot? Oh, 
Jesus, Sereva needs treatment because she's um, fighting a rat by hand. Okay, it's dead at least. Get undrafted, go for your treatment, I guess, or do what you want. Nowhere else to treat you. Um, set as medical, because I now have the extra room. And go rest until healed. Damn these mad animals. Do like my new pool table, though. Good times. Who's this being worked on by? Misty? Lots of work left, but... I'm better than nothing. And this is still staying cold enough. Large fridge is doing the trick. Um, the muffalo did get taken and butchered, fortunately. Um, the entire pack of them is wandering into our area, which I'm not too comfortable with. Tattered apparel. Sorry, but there is so much apparel on the ground. Why is none of it taken? This is a plasteel knife, 100% normal? Oh wait, that's, um, of course, Ignorant Winters, which he should take as soon as he is able. Actually, you know what, do that right now. You're pretty much full heal, fully healed. Kira's sleeping, you have your knife back. Um, why are you leaving this to rot? There's a cloth parka here. There's, um, that's pretty much, it. that's good. The leather tribal wear is pretty good. Sariva's now dressed. We do have tattered apparel on Sariva. What does, what are you wearing this tattered? Probably the toque? Anything under 50 counts as tattered, maybe? I don't know. I don't know, guys. But anyways, that's where I'm going to cut the episode. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.